sometimes in science, a ballpark answer is good enough. So in this particular um, problem, we have a piece of data here that a solution has a hydrogen ion concentration of 0.00002468 moles per liter. That be, may be way more accurate than we need for this particular situation. So sometimes you just want to write an estimation of that. And in this case, they're asking us to write an estimation that's got one significant digit. So we're going to uh, round this to the nearest number here where the numbers kick in, and then we're going to write it in scientific notation. So if I'm looking at the numbers here, the first number that's not a zero uh, reading from, from left to right is a two, and the number after that is a four. So if I were to round that, I would just keep the two. I'm rounding down here. And then if I want to figure out what exponent to put on my power of 10 in the scientific notation, I'm going to count the number of spaces to move the decimal point, one, two, three, four, five, to get it behind the two. And this is a, a small number, so it's going to be a negative exponent. So I've got two times 10 to the negative fifth. The next part of this problem says the total surface area of a country is approximately 41,830 square miles. If we're going to uh, estimate this, um, we could round it down to one digit. So I'd keep the four here because I've got a one afterwards. And then I'd count the number of spaces to move the decimal point up to between the four and the one there. So one, two, three, four. And this is a big number, so you're going to have a positive exponent. So we'd write this as four times 10 to the fourth. So that is how to estimate numbers and uh, write them in scientific notation.